is the Audi A1 A1 driving a 1.4 TFSI. These cars start from £13,400 and they go up to £20,700. So for a small car, it is expensive. The typical trait of Audi is quite a firm ride. This model has the S Tronic, which is the twin clutch gearbox, so it pre selects next gear, so very little loss of power. Of course, you've got sport mode, which I'm in now, and it gives you a bit of a quicker reaction. Let's try to keep up with the other Volvo. <coughs> I've got a T5 in front of me, you feel me? Yep. How's the handling? Uh, it's, it feels quite safe really, you know, it's typical, typical Audi. Um, but I'm going to do another circuit and then maybe push it a bit more. Yeah. Ooh. I'm not sure if the S-Tronic system on this is the best one to be honest, because it seems to be changing. Um, at different times than, uh, than I would do if it was a manual. Right. Um, did you hear the, the rev mm. strain then? Yeah. <coughs> it's a nice looking car. I think it looks a bit awkward from the back. The, the waistline of the car, the door skins are quite high. Mm. Um, so it gives you the impression that you're sitting down in a sports car. Kind of like a, a Fiat 500 waist. The steering doesn't inspire me. I wouldn't say it's numb, but it doesn't provide you the feel that you'd need so that you could read the road. Most cars have electrically assisted steering, and this is no exception but it doesn't provide you with a feel that you would get on a hydraulic. Right, with the S-Tronic system, which is standard on this 1.4 TFSI, the gear changes were, at times, a little bit unexpected, and the, the engine did strain at uh, certain times. The ride is, of course, firm, which is a, an Audi trait, and it does seem beautifully well built as you would expect from a Germanic mark, but it just seems a little bit safe to me and uh, I don't think you'd have as much fun as you would in a Fiat 500 or even a Mini for that uh, matter. This 1.4 is £115, the tax in the UK for the first year. Design features, we've got this clamshell bonnet here, quite an aggressive front grille and, uh, and bumper and we've got that high waistline which will come up to your shoulders really and you've got a reference to the TT with this aluminium or is it plastic arch At the end of the day, it is an expensive small car that will only seat four. Driven by a driver who really wants things a little bit safe. <laughs>